Tommy, son, have I got a surprise for you? I'm down at recording studios with some major artists. Why don't you pass a visit? You know it makes sense, don't ya? See you later. Tommy, remember me? Hello, Sonny. That's right, Sonny. We're all friends. You never write me, you never call. Don't you want to be friends no more? I've been busy trying to sort things out. You didn't give me a lot of support down here, Sonny. Oh, my fault, is it? Well, I've heard you've been busy, all right. Busy killing drug barons. Busy taking over. Don't forget about us, Tommy, because I can assure you, I ain't forgotten about you. Circumstances force a hasty departure, amigo. What's the problem? Ah, the French want their missile technology back, and after that last incident, I feel it is time to find safer hoppers. Wouldn't it be safer to fly? I'd be dead before I reach check-in. Besides, I need to get my merchandise out of the country. Need another gun? You, my friend, are worth ten guns. <laughs> They've got a helicopter! Tomas, you have protected and served me well. And now you must leave us before we reach the open seas. I will lower my personal launch. Keep it, my friend. A token of my gratitude. Thank you, Kern. Uh, one more request. While I'm away, could you keep an eye on Mercedes for me? I think she could look after herself, but sure, I'll keep an eye out. Gracias, amigo. Hasta luego. Adios, amigo. You serving or hanging out? I want some food. Enjoy your cheesy crust.
Oh, we gotta redecorate this place. We gotta make it look older. I can't stand this look. Tommy, what do you say? What do you say we put a bar in the- You're my lawyer, Rosenberg, not my interior decorator. Got it? Listen to me. The time to take over this town is now. It's all out there waiting for us. We need to start seizing territory and let Vice City know we're the new players in town. You know what I'm saying? What you need is a legitimate front, Tommy. Real estate. It's never done me no harm. We need to start using some muscle, or we can kiss all that hard work goodbye. Local business know Diaz is dead, and they're refusing to pay protection. Oh, we could try bribery. Bribery? Screw bribery. I'll show you how to make them scared. I'll be back here in five minutes. When your best friend's a lawyer and you're taking advice from a Texan crook, you know things ain't going well. Where are we going now, boy? Give me a break. Destroyed! Versetti, remember the name! What's eating you? There's a lot of opportunity in this town if you own the right real estate. You catch my drift. I reckon so. All I'm saying is keep your eyes open and you might find the perfect business opportunity. I'll catch you later. Later, Avery. What's the problem? Some bars refusing to pay. They reckon they're protected by a local gang of thugs. Don't worry, Tommy. I can handle it. You call this handling it? You two, off your asses. Let's go. Get in the car, useless. needs a little more protection. Ah, oh, hell, not again. I don't need this crap. Sort These out idiots operate yourself. out of DBP security around the block. You guys just sort it out amongst yourselves. I'll be seeing you later. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Yeah. Sorry, but I need that. This is... Welcome to a 10, 7, 
So if you're enjoying the show, why not make a contribution? I'm Maurice Chavez, and this is Pressing Issues. Pressing Issues is a roundtable discussion in which we ask self-important people exactly what been making mistakes. Tommy, I'm not your message boy. Well, I'm not your running man. boy. Lance, don't screw up and we won't have any problems. I screw up, you can lay it to me anytime. Tommy, I've done everything for you. You treat me like a fool. Don't do that. Lance, I won't rip you off or stab you in the back, okay? Just take it easy. This is tough enough without you getting all emotional on me. Trust me. Do you hear me? Do you hear me? I hear you, Tommy, but I can't take this much more. Lance, don't be like this. Now I'm warning you. Do you hear me? Just relax. Take a few days off. Okay? I'll talk to you. Mrs. Come Joe, on, Mrs. tough Joe. guy. Very different stuff. You moron! What were you thinking? Do you realize what this means? We could all be so... I don't know, the timer must have got screwed. That place was wired to go up like a firework factory. Then somebody tipped off the cops, but everything What's the problem, apart. fellas? Mike was supposed to torch some place in the mall, but he screwed the fuses, and now uh, the cops are crawling all over it. We gotta get our stuff and get out of here. Relax, both of you. Let me think for a second. Tommy Versetti just doesn't cut and run. Cops are gonna be going over that building with a fine-tooth comb, right? But that takes time. We gotta go in and torch that place ourselves. Yeah, but... No one but a cop could get within a mile of that place. So we go as cops. We gotta get uniforms and we're gonna need a squad car. All thanks to you, Mike. I'm sorry. I got it. All we gotta do is lure the cops in with the finger, put them in a lockup, and jump them. Good plan. Let's go. All right. What hard okay, Lance, we get get I'm not feeding each other hammer. I went out of used to build that stuff in the backwoods of Missouri. Hey, I tell you what. Yes, thank you. I expect you to listen to each other, and I will only step in when necessary so people in the air don't forget what my voice sounds like. Central attempt. 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 And remember Maurice's mother, which a very wise man, my father, once tie him up and gag him. Ooh, fits perfectly. A bit tight around the crotch, though. Oh, yeah, yeah, mine too, mine too. Easy, brother, no cop drives this bad. Remember, smile at the other cops. Hey there, officer. Nice badge, nice badge. Real smooth, Lance. Okay, timers are set. Five seconds and ticking. Five seconds! We got to get the hell out of here! Give me a 
break. He's out Clean of control. Up. Cap him. What are you doing? ain't got no class. My views ain't extreme, mister. They're common sense. And what a lot of people would say if they had the guts. If you keep letting people immigrate here from all over the so-called United States, guess what? There's no more room. We'll be piled on top of you. Oh my god! Too soon. Feel the river. River. Free. Help me! A river which runs from the coast to coast and cuts us off from the 47 states of Waste rules and bad influencers to the north. We are going to cut from Oh my god! Let's just float out to sea. Then the nation of Florida will be free to start over. There'll be no long ass lines of the log room or the pirate ship ride when I take over. You and the kids will be able to ride the rides. Oh my god! A roller coaster for each and every Florida family. You know, you're bordering on Teresa. What you are saying is a very naughty thing, and only because here on pressing issues do we believe so wholeheartedly in free speech are we allowing it. Well, it's the truth, my friend, the damn truth. And before you start, I am not a racist. Somebody help me! Other issues. But I especially hate Yankees, by which I mean anyone from Joe. Oh my god! Fame box, by your own son! Oh my god! We're going to build ourselves a river. Get to the payphone next to the mall in Washington. Train a little me. How old are you? I'm 23, but I feel much older and wiser. I know everything. I've seen a lot of the world. What does the rest of the world have to tell us about how to do things? Build more trains? Have people elect their leader rather than an elite electoral college? Ride a bike to work like a Girl Scout? Or a clown with dietary concerns? No thanks, Vladimir. I'm Hey, brilliant, bloody brilliant. Hey, Tommy, glad you could make it. Hey, you ever met Love Fist before? No, I haven't, but I've always loved your music. Let me introduce you to the band. This is Per Percy, Dick, uh, Willie's in the car's here, and that was Jez in the booth earlier. And guys, I want you to meet a good friend of mine. This is Tommy. We go way back. Hey, pal. And, uh, what was your name again? Hey, <laughs> Jez, you remember. Lovefest. Don't be Did playing you? them games with me, Did mate. You? I'm too crafty for that sunshine. English. Good See, one America. The, the thing is, Tom, mental. the boys totally need some help. They ain't too connected here. They don't have the old ass, totally your father. We need some drugs, pal! Gotta get on the old <laughs> love yeah, fest, yeah, nice beauty, you know? Yeah! Well, this is Vice City, man. What's the problem? Love juice, man. We need love juice, man, can? Love juice? Aye, two parts boom shine, one part trumpet, five fizz bombs, and a liter of petrol. Can you help us out, pal? Oh, we really mean a lot You could do boys. that for the boys, right?
I will not. I shall not. I cannot. Looking for something special? I got what you need. Thanks for the money, sucker. Where we can debate things mano a mano, and I find myself having statistics hurled at me like so much stale confetti. We cannot boil people down to numbers. You have no idea, my friend, what it takes to serve the sacrifices I've made to help my country, to help Vice City. <laughs> hey, Mike, the guy's to do with some company, if you know what I mean. I know just the girl. Hello, the native hey Mercedes. Hiya, Tommy. And how are you? Just fine. Listen, fancy having a love fest? Okay. But just as a favor, I expect return. Groin. X. I see you later, big boy. Public safety. How do we get guns under control in this city? By giving everyone hope, a dream of a better tomorrow. Sunshine, no school, no tax, free barbecue and pen. All right, fancy clothes, let's see what you can do. What about the guy who is standing there saying, I like being part of America. I like it a lot. I get public radio. I can hear Maurice Chavez. I own a small one-bedroom home, a business selling flowers to people stuck in traffic. Three or four radios all turned on to BCPR. A dog, 15 ice cubes. But I don't feel safe. I'm worried about gangs. Gangs are a myth put out by the liberal elite to patronize and demean the working man. I mean... Ward off predators. And that's supposed to terrify people? No, no. We believe passionately in non violent Hey, Rossetti, Cougar says you can handle a bike pretty good. Yeah, how many more errands am I going to have to run? I'm a very busy man. It's a fight that's going to sell this, then bring it on. Being one of us ain't just about brawling. It's about being part of a family. Yeah, I've been part of a family before, all right? It didn't work out. Yeah, right, but this family takes care of its own. We don't ask a man to do the dirty work and then let him do 15 years hard time. Yeah, that's right, I've done my homework. This here's the biggest family of misfits, outcasts, and badasses. Hell, some of us have even been betrayed by our own country. I was locked up during non-ugly business. Which is why I'm going to ask you to go mess with the man. This whole damn country needs a kick in the ass, and we're the ones to deliver it. So get out there, grab a bike, and show this city how pissed you are. Ten fifty-five. Eight of 
you can fight for your patch. The local street gang made the mistake of stealing my hog. Probably because of some machismo thing or something. Me and the boys would go over there and teach them a lesson in respect and all. <laughs> Anyways, then I got to thinking, this would make a good initiation for you. You get my bike back, you can tell Paul he's got his security. Because I'm a man of the people. Vote shrub. You'll get richer and you won't feel guilty about it. Enough! We're running out of time. A river. People, I'm telling you, pick up your spades, go into your garden, start digging as deep and as far as you can. Pretty soon the whole state will be flooded and ruined, and then they'll have to leave. We must build a moat to the north or they will come down and ruin this great state. And Mr. Hickory, were you born in Florida? <laughs> what a stupid question of all the cheek. Were you? Of course not. No one's been born in Florida since 1877, but I've been here for five years, which is a very long time. Yes, it is. A very long time. Almost as long. Hut one, two. Hut one, two. Hut, hut. Get his security for the gig. You have my word on that. Now keep yourself out of trouble. 